157, it's going to be Patty Gallagher for Ohio State, David Berkovich for Columbia. Coach has been very high on Berkovich in the room, says uh, he's been looking really good in preseason and offseason, heading into the season. Um, not easy to translate that right to competition, but let's see what he could do versus a ranked Patty Gallagher, number 16th in the country right now again for Ohio State. Gallagher had a tough test in his first duel of the year, falling to number six Bryce Andonian of Virginia Tech. Yeah, it's a tough first test. Two really good guys, Andonian from Virginia Tech, really tough wrestler. Got a win over Colin Roberts of Edinburgh. 40 seconds elapsed here in period one, still no score. Gallagher went for the shot, nicely defended there by Berkovich. For her best five wins last season for Berkovich, wrestled at 165 for the last two years. Yeah, down to 157, that's a big jump, going down eight pounds to compete at. Just over a minute elapsed here, Berkovich went for the shot, nothing there. Kind of a combination of being off balance and Gallagher snapping him down as he was shooting and lowering his level. Berkovich able to uh, recover, though. Get right back to the hand fight. Keep it even. Both guys just trying to hold their ground. Gallagher doing a little bit better job of being offensive and taking space on an attack now. Single leg, looking to get through the backside and get two legs. Berkovich doing a good job on a heavy wizard, putting all the weight towards the mat, trying to separate his hands, pull his hands up. Gallagher with a takedown, three points there. Minute 20 to go, three points for Patty Gallagher. He's up three to nothing. Gallagher's got a cross wrist tight here. Got the wrist tied up all the way across Berkovich's body. Now changing it to a different hold. Berkovich just trying to crawl, maybe get out of bounds and pause things, and he does. So 59 seconds to go here in period one. Riding time at 23 seconds. It's a three to nothing lead for Patty Gallagher. It could help a lot to get that whistle start sometimes, get that restart, get out of bounds on bottom, get that fresh start, able to seal off, not let them start with a wrist or start with an ankle hook. First minute and 30 seconds or so, just a lot of hand fighting and checking. Gallagher with a quick shot. And Gallagher looking to cut, looking to build his lead. All these Ohio State guys looking to push the pace, looking to keep scoring points, be exciting. Berkovich with an escape, score now 3-1. to one. Under 45 seconds to go here in period one. Patty Gallagher is starting to really tie things together with his snap down fakes and now a shot followed up with all that motion, making it an easy finish, starting to wear down Berkovich a little bit, it looks like. Under 30 seconds and a six to one lead for Gallagher. Berkovich extended that right arm, but Gallagher now looks like he's got an arm bar or something close to it. Berkovich. Strolls out of bounds, six to one lead for Gallagher. 14 seconds to go here in period one. 45 seconds of riding time. 14 seconds left here in this period would be a good time to explode and try to sneak an escape here. Columbia's still looking to get its first win of the day. Now at 10 seconds. Patty Gallagher able to stop the first move, keep the pressure on Berkovich's hands, keep him down for the last 14 seconds. Gallagher going right ahead and choosing bottom to start the second period. Winning six to one, almost at a minute, 59 seconds on the riding time. Second period starting here. Gallagher looks like he's going to get an escape, and he's got it. He's up 7-1. to one. Minute 40 to go here in period two. Gallagher trying to snap him down. A stalling warning against Berkovich. You know, Gallagher is controlling the center, pushing the pace. Berkovich got to do a good job. I hear his coach is saying, you got to go, you got to go. Another shot right to the leg. Berkovich kind of froze up. Three points for Gallagher now up 10 to 1. 
Berkovich has to wrestle through these positions a little bit more. Can't stop wrestling on your feet at all. 10 to 2 the score now. Berkovich gets an escape point. Patty Gallagher picking up pace, keeping Berkovich on the edge. Another stalling against Berkovich. Makes it makes it 11 to 2 here. One minute left in the second period. And Patty, Gow Patty Gallagher really picking up the pace here. Just you could tell momentum's just starting to swing in his favor. There's that shot from Gallagher, single leg. Keeping the tempo, and there's three points. Yeah, the, the takedown's just getting easier as he picks up the pace, and the moment, momentum just continues to climb. 14 to 3 now with that escape and out of bounds. Gallagher is coming as advertised. He's described as a guy who loves to attack, keeps a high tempo, quickly going into shots. Under 45 seconds here in the second period, and Gallagher's up 14 to 3. And another shot to a snap down goal behind, making it 17 to 3. And another cut here with 35 seconds left in the second. No escape awarded. I don't know if I saw an escape awarded. He's going to have to let him all the way up. Nothing on the board. Gallagher, I think he's just going to let Berkovich up. 17-4, takedown ends it here. 20 seconds left here in the second period. Berkovich not able to respond. Patty Gallagher takes the technical fall. 21-4 riding time. Patty Gallagher just too quick for David Berkovich. Patty Gallagher gets the victory. 21 to 4, the final at 157. So a tech fall win. Ohio State goes up 24 to nothing.